is going on guys it is rexy here welcome back to another one versus one rank duel now before we get into the osiris buff buffs time for some pain okay that's a sick voice pack um that have come of as of late um i want to show something off real quick um available right now or very soon we are going to have the snowball merchandise I'm gonna go through it and mess around with my merch a little more, um, because I don't really, I'm not, I'm, I don't like update myself on my merch enough nowadays, uh, and I don't, I haven't been adding enough new merch. But we have a new shirt. I don't know why my lower thirds are. No, that's actually kind of convenient because I'm talking about merchandise. Um, but anyways, so listen. <coughs> so there's the new snowball shirts. I showed the the sketch off in the actual video, but it is now complete, and we're working on the designs for the actual shirts themselves. Um, so this is the the actual look of it right now if i can get my display capture working but a boom but a bing i'm thinking of having like a smaller logo near like where like a an upper t-shirt pocket would be maybe or just like you know like it would fit on the top right of your top left of your shirt uh, but i think that's the idea we're going for let me know what you guys think of the design i think it's really cool i really like it king snowball remember half of the proceeds um half of all the profit made from these i'm gonna try and make them as cheap as i possibly can for you guys and half of all the profits will be going to um, uh, the organization, the SPCA. Uh, the organization that we're doing a fundraiser for this weekend that you definitely should stop by and say hello to because it is going to be a lot of Perhaps fun. A method of suffering I am not familiar with. And I'm very much looking forward to it. Um, so let's just see just how good these Osiris buffs are. Now, they increased the scaling on his one by 5%, if I'm not mistaken. But the big thing is, is that his ult range has officially been uh, increased by like 10 units. So he's got some longer range ults now, which is probably the biggest buff about this. The scaling on the one's definitely nice, especially since it's such a, such a low cooldown uh, ability, right? That's fine. Oh, yeah. Come back. I really like this skin. Yeah, I could tell that was gonna hurt. Alright, no biggie though. We got lost to sustain. That's the C, but. He doesn't have as many health potions as us, so overall. Did that hit? Maybe. Oh, that would have 100% killed if I hit that one. Oh! It dinged, bro! I thought you could sneak by and get some heal so I wouldn't be able to kill you? Crazy, baby. Crazy. Okay. Whoa! Holy crap, that feels so far! It used to be like just to here. Oh my god. Alright, chill out there, Edge, edge Lord. Um, so yeah, by a whole 10 units, 55 to 60. 65. Wow, that is. <laughs> It's an interesting buff, and it's also really nice because we're up, up against um, an Anubis right now, so we get the anti heal on our passive, right? Our ult's passive. I suppose just our ultimate, you'd say. So it's Thanksgiving uh, here in Canada. Uh, I know it's not Thanksgiving in America and everything. But, you know, regardless, it might not be Thanksgiving for you, but I hope you are thankful and appreciative of things in your life. You know damn well I am. Appreciate you guys. I love you. I'm not gonna get a sap, a sappy again like I did in the, the Pokemon video. Boom! Oh. Ooh. My three didn't go off. Oh my god! I almost screwed myself. Mitigations for my three were definitely what I was going for there. But unfortunately, not even just damage reduction, I guess. Toss a coin to your witcher. Oh, well, no. So, since we already have Ansel in a kit, we don't need to rush Toxic Blade too fast. So, we'll actually go the more safe route, which I don't like building like this that much, but. 
realistically, if you want to win, you should go this kind of build. <laughs> I'll be honest. Your middle tower is under attack. See, I'm trying to surround as much hype as I can for the fundraiser on Saturday. I want as many people there as we could possibly get. I got some really cool reward ideas. Fundraiser goals, like, that I'll be doing. Once we hit them, we're still thinking of some. But we've got majority of them. I'll have to buy Snowball a bunch of catnip. We'll have the Snowball Cam all stream, of course. Snowball will be our featured guest. Okay, let's drop our blue. Doing really good so far. Fatty two kills. So on the the topic of being thankful, how are you guys today? I find it's pretty funny that I'm actually raising money to money to the money for a charity. Um, like right on around Thanksgiving. So that's pretty funny. I hope your day's awesome as well. And I saw there was like one or two guys that had questions about the charity. And they thought it was scummy. <clears throat> so what they, what this guy said, the audacity, like the, I, I couldn't imagine having this perspective. He said that it's scummy that I'm raising money with my community because I might make more money than some of the people donating, and because I'm not singularly, singularly just donating on my own, that it makes me a scumbag. What in the fuck kind of logic is that? I'm trying to do something nice and help out. And yes, I, I, I can help out and I'm going to help out. I'm going to match to a certain percentage of what we're doing. I'm thinking I'm going to down, uh, download. I think I'm going to donate well over 500 bucks or something. You know, it depends, like, just how the event goes. I'm going to obviously help myself. But you also got to put in perspective, just because I'm, like, I might make a decent amount of money. You know, I, I have a life too, you know. Like, you never know. YouTube could die at any point now. If I'm not responsible and everything... I'm, j I'm just using this as an opportunity, because I can. I have a community surrounding me, and, you know, we could do something nice together. It's not, like, just because, you know, I make a decent amount of money, like, all of a sudden I'm just, you know, I'm forced to do that. Like, no one even has to donate. I'm just saying that it's possible now with what we've done and the community we've, we've created. I don't, I just don't, I, there's so many layers to how rude that is to say, like, and how, like, from your own perspective and ignorant you have to be to just think like, wow, he did that fast. I would have ulted that, my friend. Drop the base. Forgive me, master. I must go all I, out. I think that's just so rude, man. Especially, like, when we're trying to do something nice. Like, ugh. There's obviously people like that, though. It's just, it, like, it's, you know, I understand there's people's perspectives in everything, but something like this, where it's something so good and genuine that I'm, like, trying to do, to still have someone like that, like, just find a, any reason to hate on anything, man. Oh, my God. That's so sad. Just having that mentality and not being able to put yourself in someone else's shoes. <sighs> it's weird to me, man. Mm, it's going double anti as well. But, or double. Just damn it, bro. It's a shame if I just didn't give a shit. Let me tap that ass. Alright, we'll go Toxic Links, I guess. We're gonna have a lot of HP in this. Uh, actually, we could use some actual power. Congratulations, you just killed yourself. I suck! No! Oh! That's what I would have said if I was scared. <clears throat> One tick. Oh, I hit him for 86. God damn it. Okay. You know what? I may. Maybe. Like, just maybe. It's not certain. But that might not have been a great idea. No, oh, wait, wait, I guess we'll, we'll just rush Toxic, I guess. Lots of HP to burn through for him. <laughs> Obviously not one of my best decisions, you know? You see, you could criticize that, bro. You can call me out all you want, because, you know, you could have a valid reason. Like, oh my god, Rex, you're a fucking moron. Why would you ever just move up there? You had, like, no HP. You know, you almost killed, you missed your two like a fucking moron. You suck at the game. Yeah, true. I, I agree with you with that. 
But man, we're trying to save puppies and shit and rescue literally abused animals. And this man's like, oh, nope. Pfft. Not wholesome enough for me, bro. Not enough. Oh, God, you can't fuck with the timing. Ugh, I love animals, man. Oh, my God. It was hard for me to pick what kind of charity I wanted to, you know, help out of, because there's so many good causes out there and things that are, you know, worth supporting. Oh my god. I thought animals were so perfect. Something local, too. It just feels awesome. I'll be streaming today, by the way, a couple hours after these are uploaded. I will definitely be uploading a video on YouTube saying that I am going to be live. Definitely power in this build now, though. Could go stone cutting. Mm. Okay, he is going a dirty hot build. No, I think if I catch him out, he just dies. Relatively certain. I was gonna die there regardless. I guess to reset the tower uh, damage. Fortunately, I don't have physical protections or anything, so I kind of screwed myself there. Um, no, Ichabol, 100%. 100% Ichabol, what am I saying here? I know Atalanta's was nerfed, so Silver Branch. So very slightly, but should still be fine. The ult range definitely feels awesome. And like, the only reason I'm even dying, like, 80, like, literally my only two deaths are diving this tower, and then <laughs> staying for too long. So that's not what we're worried about here. We're not worried about outplaying and everything. It's just me overextending. Oh, who'd have thought? A Rexy video where this happens? Oh my god, that's so unlike him. That's what you're all saying right now. I'll get it, alright? Stop making fun of me. I'm set to do. I faced a speed hacker on Friday when I was streaming. Funniest shit ever, man. I wish I wasn't. I wish I didn't have music going during that because the reactions, like us, like we all had, me and chat, to this guy very clearly speed hacking. Funniest shit, man. Oh my god. So this guy really needs to just leave that tower line. Oh my god. Just move up, I beg of you. Bro, like I'm tired of playing this tower diving game. He's just not used to it. it. That must be it. The only reason he would have ever moved up that far is because he was not used to the range. Fuck, I wouldn't. I'm not gonna be. Or I'm not gonna get used to that range for a while, man. That is crazy different. So many weird changes this patch. Like distance changes and stuff. Like jumps and all. I'm just gonna clear the front ones so that those guys move up so that our archer is actually coming right to the Phoenix. Fortunately, we're not gonna kill it or anything. It's a decent bit of poke, though. Oh my god, he sprinted! Just go, bro. Just go. You go ahead and take that. Yeah, it's all yours, Broski. You're gonna let me back, too, right? You're a nice gentleman. You're gonna go for your wave. You know, we're gonna go our separate ways. We will bring suffering. Um, I may go with serrated? I don't think I really need- I, like, stone cutting would be more than enough, realistically. I could e either way just go into serrated if I wanted to. If he goes another defense item. Like, we don't need percentage pen, especially against only 40 protections. Like, we could go stone cutting. I can't just build complete. Probably a bit of an overcap, maybe? No, not even. Good. God damn it, he's on bull demon. No way I'm stopping that. Maybe if he didn't sprint. There we go. 
Easy money, boys. Let's go. Fatty ult. So much anti heal on him right there. That's Phoenix as well. Hope it was worth it, bro. You fool. I expected more from my... My rival. I had higher expectations. I bought my real life buddies, uh, Fall Guys. They've been loving it. Trying to get them their first win. That wasn't worth. Alright, I'm about to say, I'll go, I'll take you out now. I got my old. Ooh, to be fair though, well, I mean, if you're trying to go off my builds, like. embarrassing for both of us I just wanted to explain to them the build and it was why I realistically will sell root I, like right now I probably should have built after stone cutting or even before stone cutting I should have built another defense item bulwark perhaps for the CCR which helps it's uh, you can every time you get rafts it doesn't last as long because that's how CCR works and bulwarks really good with that as well as the additional HP just nice which forces him to get something like soul reaver or something um, that would have been better right here, and then stone cutting perhaps, and then you could sell Rune for something else, right? You don't need double defense. It's preference. But we definitely needed Ichabod for the power boost. Stone cutting is like our proc shred. Yeah, so it's minus 30 protections, and he's only got, what, 40? Not including his base. Like, we are doing, we are gonna be fine. <laughs> well, it beats up the next fight. Yeah, I'd finish this up next, though. Oh, with a Kins, probably. Maybe. Kins would be okay. Crusher. Two more attacks. You got Atlantis if you wanted to. Oh, up. Additional anti-heal. That fucking blows, actually. He's not close enough for me to apply my anti-heal. So I beat the slow there, uh, so it all uh, not only does slow this three, but his mid guard as well is able to stick to him, secure the kill. Might as well use my beads since I was not holding on to it. And the game. Alright, nice. If you guys are watching the video, make sure you like the video. Like, new to the channel, please consider subscribing for more awesome content like this. Be sure to check out, uh, keep up to date on the merch. The new shirts will be out soon. I will definitely announce on video when they do come out. I was Nixon, guys. Have a fantastic day, of course. Bye bye.